In the name of God, the compassionate, the merciful. Uh, Mr. Chairman, I have to first uh, uh, express my appreciation uh, to you as the president of this very important session that focuses on the situation of uh, Afghan refugees. I would like also uh, to express my gratitude to the High uh, Commissioner, UN High Commissioner on Refugees and his very competent uh, colleagues who organized this meeting. And I hope the conclu our conclusions uh, uh, and what we obtain at the end of this uh, meeting uh, will help us to reduce the suffering of these refugees and uh, in uh, assisting the development of uh, Afghanistan, we will um, prepare the ground for the return of Afghan refugees to their country. Uh, Mr. President, uh, Excellencies, our fate is determined uh, by geography to a certain extent. Afghanistan and Iraq are both sources of important flows of refugees and asylum seekers in the past decades. Mizbani as Bozor Tarin Jam Yetapanohandagan. Um, we have been host to a um, most important uh, refugee uh, populations. And consequently, the Islamic Republic of Iran is actually uh, one of the first countries hosting refugees in the world. This has been achieved on the basis of our religious teachings and humanitarian principles. However, we have had to incur important expenses while um, we have been facing the absence of sufficient international support. Today, the refugees enjoy job opportunities, primary, secondary, higher and professional education. Also, they enjoy health services above many international standards. Many of them are now more educated and healthier than they were before. This will have certainly a positive uh, bearing on the reconstruction of Afghanistan. We have done all this. While we were facing the negative impacts of the war and unjust sanctions that were imposed on us. Mr. Chairman, Problem um, problems are in uh, livelihood and uh, that have their source in instability and underdevelopment, they contribute actually to population movements. Promoting stability and reconstruction in Afghanistan and Iraq is a major commitment for the international community. The Islamic Republic of Iran has not only hosted refugees, it has also supported both neighboring governments uh, in their efforts to um, achieve stability and development. 
We believe that the practical solution for uh, the problems of uh, Afghan refugees should be sought in the in, in their home country. From our point of view, the most appropriate. Durable solution uh, for resolving the refugee situation is the voluntary return to their homeland. Uh, the Islamic Republic of Iran, in the past 30 years, has focused its policies on this actually objective, the concrete participation of Iran in the reconstruction of Afghanistan has its source in this vision. I would like to emphasize for the realization of voluntary repatriation, not only the refugees should be willing to return, it is necessary uh, to set up the proper conditions for the reintegration and return and reintegration. I would like to once again request the international community to have a more active role in the reconstruction of Afghanistan and to do the necessary for the voluntary repatriation and durable return of Afghan refugees to their country. The main needs of Afghan refugees must be faced uh, with their own participation in the reconstruction of their country. Mr. Chairman, I would like to inform you that according to the decisions made during the international conference and the solution strategy for Afghan refugees, to support voluntary repatriation, sustainable Reintegration and assistance to host countries that was held in May 2012 in Geneva. The fourth meeting of the Quadripartite Steering Committee on the Solution Strategy and Voluntary Repatriation. And sustainable reintegration and assistance to host countries uh, in which uh, the Islamic Republic of Iran, Afghanistan, and Pakistan participated, and also UNHCR. These are the members of the Quadripartite and also in presence of the Special Representative of the UN Secretary General in Afghanistan. This meeting took place in 19 May 2015 in Iran. The participants emphasized the commitment to the principle of voluntary repatriation of Afghan refugees. They also emphasized and the, the importance of uh, solution strategies for, uh, for the Afghanistan Afghanistan. Uh, and identifying and implementing durable solutions for Afghan refugees so that they can return in dignity and safety in the framework of solutions strategy. The participants also emphasize uh, and the importance of including an agenda item on the issue of returnees in the Afghanistan reform agenda. 
جهت بازگشت داوطلبانه پناهندگان به افغانستان و ادغام مجدد آنها در کشورشان حمایت نمود. متعاقب برگزاری کنفرانس بین المللی در ماه مه 2012 در جنیف تهی سالهای 2013 During 2013 and 2014, a number of projects were defined and implemented in Iran. اخیراً نیز در چهارچوب راهل‌های راهبردی پروژه‌های سال‌های 2015-2016 در جمهوری اسلامی ایران با همکاری ارگان‌های دولتی، کمیساری‌های عالی ملل متحد در امور پناهندگان، برخی از آجانس های سازمان ملن و سازمان های غیر دولتی داخلی و بین المللی تعریف شده است. امیدوارم با اجرای مؤثر این ترها و تأمین اعتبارات لازم برای آنها به سر مناسبی جهت تقویت روند بازگشت داوطلبانه پناهندگان افغانی به کشورشان و کمک به ادغام مجدد پایدار آنها در افغانستان فراهم گردد. در خاتمه مایلم تأکید نمایم که مسئله پناهندگان دارای ماهیتی بین المللی می باشد و مسئولیت آنیز متوجه جامعه جهانی بوده و ضرورت دارد که جامعه بین المللی indispensable that the international community and also the developed countries assume the responsibility entirely with regard to this question. It is also necessary to take urgent measures for به بازگشت داوطلبان پناهندگان به کشورشان و نیز اسکان مجدد آنها به ویژه از میان پناهندگان آسیب پذیر اتخاذ کرد. جمهوری اسلامی ایران علارغم محدودیت های موجود بار این مسئولیت را به دوش کشیده است اما این یک تعهد و مسئولیت مشترک است که اجرای آن کمک شایانی به ارتقای صلح و توسعه در سطح منطقی و بین المللی می نماید to regional and international peace and development. Let's join hands to achieve this noble objective. Join hands to achieve this noble objective. Thank you for your attention.